it is time for a Diamond Select Toys Tour booth. Ooh, 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 so excited. Zach Oat, marketing supervisor for DST. How you doing? I'm doing good, man. How are you? I am great. I'm caffeinated. I don't even know where to start. Start me off. Uh, I'll start you off with our Marvel Gallery lines. The PVC diorama is $45, really affordable price point for some really detailed sculptures. Uh, we're showing off a bunch of new stuff here. Uh, we've got a Mr. Sinister, can you believe it? We've got a new Spider-Man. Uh, we've already done one, but this is a new uh, version where he's got the web going across the buildings. Very cool. Uh, we've got an Angela, which is very, very neat. Uh, and of course, we've got a whole bunch more that we haven't even offered to customers yet, but that we are, we've been showing off. Yeah, there's tons of uh, stuff based on Marvel Studios Avengers Infinity War. I know you guys have some uh, action figures. You've got all kinds of stuff, busts and different things. What's the Avengers Infinity War stuff particularly? Uh, we do have that those galleries I mentioned. Black Widow here. Uh, this is, uh, again, $45 PVC diorama. Very detailed, um, but we're doing all the main cast members. Uh, we had a couple different Black Panthers. We got uh, Cap, we got Thanos. Um, and uh, we also have a bunch of our larger scale resin statues, um, which are um, milestones, we call it, uh, and also premiere collections are slightly smaller. Uh, we're doing like a massive Hulkbuster, massive Thor, and a massive Thanos. All very cool stuff. Um, and uh, the smaller scale, we're going to have a Spider-Man uh, in his Iron Spider outfit. Um, and we've also been releasing some Minimates recently, the, um, our little two-inch uh, posable figures. Now, I, I want to talk about Minimates as well, because uh, one of my favorite comics right now is Avengers by Jason Aaron and McGinnis Paco Medina, and they are exploring the Avengers of 1 million BC. You have some Minimates based on those characters as well, right? Uh, yeah, we're going to be releasing a set exclusively at Walgreens, which is uh, four two-packs. Oh, with the full member of the Avengers, full team of the Avengers, and also the Fallen. Uh, but here you can see uh, how cute they are. This is Black Panther, the, I guess the first Black Panther. He's got the panther skin, he's got the tail. And uh, these are fully articulated, they got 14 points of articulation. And the parts are fully interchangeable, so you can take off the arm, and you can put the arm on somebody else and have him be Black Panther. Uh, we're doing more Minimates too, based on uh, the animated series that are out there now. So like Guardians of the Galaxy, Spider-Man, uh, Avengers Secret Wars. This is our first ever uh, Hammerhead. Mini -made. I'm a big fan of the Spider-Man uh, crime bosses. So we got Hammerhead, first ever Hammerhead we've ever made, even comic, whatever. And uh, you can see some of the packaging here. This is also an Mark Walgreens exclusive line. So you've got, uh, this is Doctor Strange and Ghost Rider from uh, Avengers Secret Wars. Uh, I see over there you have a Thanos. Yeah, this is our um, this is our comic-based Thanos. Um, this is our Marvel Gala line. Again, $45, uh, 45 to $50. Uh, and this one is going to be exclusively at GameStop. Uh, you can see standing on his Mountain of Skulls. and been ready to tear an Avenger apart. I saw over here there's also some busts. Uh, uh, what's this line of busts? Uh, we're doing these larger busts. It's called our Legends in 3D, uh, Legends in Three Dimensions. Uh, it's a brand we've picked up. Um, you may have seen some, uh, some from them a long time ago, but uh, we're doing a sort of a, a series of half scale resin busts. They're about 10 inches tall, and uh, we've uh, recently shown off Deadpool and Venom, but here we're unveiling uh, Spider Man, Iron Man, Captain America, and Spider Gwen. So we've got four new reveals, and uh, it's, it's, they're, they're awesome. They're very, very cool, and uh, they're big. Was there anything else you guys brought showing off at Comic-Con for the first time? Uh, for the very first time, we are showing off the Marvel Select action figures, which everybody loves. Um, we teased our Infinity War figures with black silhouettes um, because they weren't fully finalized, but now we're showing off uh, Nomad Captain America from Infinity War, we're showing uh, Thor from that final scene in Infinity War, and he comes with a, a tween group, and we're showing off Iron Spider. Um, and uh, we also have one that we're showing off for the very first time, which is our 90s era Rogue uh, from the X-Men. So she's, uh, she's a, fan of, a frequently fan of any character. Yeah. Got to get one of those for Kelly Thompson, who uh, is writing Mr. and Mrs. X. It's great. Uh, Zach, before we go, I do want to shout you out because you are one of my favorite toy photographers. And the toy photography that you do for Diamond Select Toys uh, is, is so good. Do you have any tips for anyone who's watching who may want to start photographing their action figures, their toys, all that good stuff? Uh, you know, I mean, some people use like really elaborate light setup, stuff like that. I just buy these little lights from like the dollar store. You can get like clip-on lights, like something you do in a closet, and like a little clip-on stuff. Like they're like a dollar and you know, you can't replace the batteries and you just toss them, throw them away. And you just clip them different places. You can backlight, side light, and uh, get low angles on stuff to make it look bigger and more realistic. Some people shoot down at the stuff and they can tell their toys, but if you shoot up at it, it looks like it's uh, like some towering godlike creature. And it's a, uh, it's fun. It's a lot of fun, but it's really something you can do. I, I do a lot of it on my mobile phone just because I want to upload it to Twitter or Instagram right away. And I, you know, I have a good camera, a pretty good camera that I use for work. But um, but really, I just I just like to snap pictures wherever I am, like in the airport <laughs> or here on the hall. I was shooting stuff and. Uh, it's just everywhere you go, just bring something in your pocket. Yeah, I, I love when you shoot outdoors, like grass and woodland areas. It just looks so good. Just want to make sure people knew. 
you're that guy for Diamond Select. Thank you. Yeah, check us out on um, Instagram.com slash CollectDST, uh, Twitter slash CollectDST, and on Facebook, we're uh, Diamond Select Toys, all one word. But uh, we post up, I post some of my pictures there, and uh, you can get the new news about what's coming out. Cool. Thank you, Zach.